Hi, I'm Craig with AppliancePhideo.com. Today, we'll be taking a look at the run capacitor on this Maytag VMW washing machine. Stop. Before beginning any repair, always be sure to disconnect the power to the appliance. It is also recommended to test the outlet for the proper voltage. Remember to also turn off the water. When looking at your run capacitor, there are a couple of symptoms you want to look for. First of all, it might not be spinning out. Your washing machine might not start. There's some loud noises that will make a very, very loud humming noise that you'll notice whenever you're having a bad run capacitor. Uh, sometimes you'll notice there will be an LED indicator here that's blinking red. This isn't 100% of the time, but usually if it is a bad run capacitor. Click on the link below to view this repair video. AppliancePhideo.com guides you step by step, giving you the confidence to avoid recalls and callbacks, also saving time on repairs. Whether you're up against an uncommon repair or the latest appliance on the market, our videos have been created with you in mind. Our growing library of videos have been produced using our factory certified technicians who have extensive infield experience over the past 30 years. AppliancePhideo.com provides high quality repair videos that anyone can follow, regardless of their skill level. We are here to help. Click on the link below to view this repair video and let us help you do it right the first time.